guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am coming at you with a Rat Tech student video. I wanted to get this up before I leave because I'm headed out for military duty and I'm batch filming a lot of content before I leave so I can have something for y'all to watch. Um, but I wanted to show you guys kind of what I've compiled so far in my backpack, like my Rat Tech bag. Um, I've been doing a lot of research. We haven't had any, um, like our professors haven't put out a, I guess a school supply list. I can't remember, is that something that, I'm sure like when we start class, the syllabus will have it on there, but I've been watching a lot of videos, TikToks. There's not a whole lot that's out there right now, but I've, what I've been watching, I've kind of compiled what people recommended. So, let's get into the video. I almost forgot the most important thing, which I will get to in a minute. First things first, this is my backpack. Um, this is a North Face. I don't know what the style is, but I've had this since I was a, um, I've had this since I was a, what is it? A senior in high school. I had this backpack. It even still has like the monogram that Amanda, I asked Amanda to put on here. You can't really see it anymore, but monogram was like super popular back when I was in high school and Obviously my parents aren't gonna, weren't gonna go get me a, a personalized monogram backpack. So we used a Sharpie marker and put it in there. This also lasted me through college. Um, and this will last me through ed tech school. Um, it was like 70 bucks uh, when I was in high school, which was super expensive back then. I like used up some of my summer money, like summer uh, job money and, and bought it or something at, at one point. But yeah, all right, so backpack. I think I'll also have like a little crossbody purse as well, um, just for like little knickknacks and stuff if I need it. Um, let's start in here. I don't really have much. I have like hair ties. Oh, what a score. Okay, hair ties are in here. And I, honestly, I just have to kind of go through this stuff because I think I still have a lot. I also use this as a travel bag, so I have a lot of travel stuff in there too. Um, but I've got lots of pins, um, highlighters, markers. This is also, um, in, uh, what is this, white out. I use this for work too, so yeah. Um, I have a pencil bag and there's some more pins in here as well. I just wanted to keep organized. I know I lose a lot of pins, um, so hopefully this will help me. I need to get some pencils. I do have some mechanical pencils. Funny story, some that are, have, I have still from like high school and college that I never touched. I think I still have the .7 lead because that was like the only kind of lead I liked. I still have the same one that I bought my senior year in high school. Like I haven't even opened it yet. So I'm gonna use that and then I need to clean this out. This is like travel tickets and stuff. But pencil bag, put all my pencils, highlighters and whatnots in there. Oh, here's another pencil, zip, zip, okay. Um, and then I have some paper. I don't know. I just thought maybe I'd use it. I had a lot of paper when I was studying for the teas. Um, and I was like, I don't want it to go to waste, so I'll just use it. I do need to get some binders. I don't have any binders yet. Um, I just saw how many classes or like what our class schedule is kind of looking like. Um, they just, um, assigned us up for them. So I'll have to kind of figure out, I think once we start school, how many binders I need. Um, because I just don't want to have like more things than I than I really need. Um, so got some paper. Um, and then I've got some binders. Not binders. I just said I didn't have any. Um, some notebooks. I these are written in actually. Um, this one especially. This is my anatomy notebook that I had, and I just still have a lot of um like extra space. I don't like to waste notebooks, so I'll just end up just using the rest of it. Um, but this is my anatomy, and I heard that some students, they do like a little crash course, so I will keep that and just have it to refer to if I need to. But yeah, tons of binder, or Courtney! <laughs> tons of uh, notebooks. <laughs> um, these are just regular notebooks. I think I might, um, I know a lot of the kids are going back to school next month or the next few weeks. Um, so a lot of school supplies are out like in Walmart um, and like Target and all, you know, all those stores So I'll probably uh, grab some more but I just thought I'd use like the, uh, the notebooks that I had uh, So they don't go to waste like I barely wrote in this one I was studying for the T's and I had like a notebook for every single subject 
Um, this is a, my anatomy notebook too, I think I used. I also got some cute folders, which I can just go ahead. Are they all the same? Oh no, they're different patterns. I got these from Marshalls for $5.99. Super cute, flowery folders. There's different styles. Looks like there's three different styles. And then six um, came in there. So yeah, two, e two, of, two of each, three designs. Oh, cool. So yeah, really cute if you guys care. This is um, Lady Jane is what it's called, but I got these from Marshalls. Um, and then also from Marshalls, Oh, what is this? Oh, this is from a doll. I need to keep that. Um, I got a really cute binder. Why do I keep saying fucking binder, dude? Like, what the hell is wrong with you, Courtney? Um, I got a planner for this new year because Maya ran out in July. Um, and this was $7.99. This is so cute. It has like a velvet um like cover on the on the front and back, and then or the cover. I can't speak today. Um, but yeah, it goes up into, what is it? January of next, no, January of 2026. So I will have this for like the majority of the beginning. Wait, yeah, like I'll have this up until the year I graduate. I graduate um, summer of 2026. So I'll have to get a new one once I start my last semester, last two semesters. So this is very important. I literally could not have survived getting a bachelor's degree without having some sort of planner. I think that's when I started getting a planner. A lot of, I think we also in high school had agenda books that they provided for you every year. And yeah, it's just, you can't keep everything up in your noggin. I mean, a lot of people like to have their phones, but a lot of, sometimes my phone, like I forget to set an alert or I just don't really think to look at the calendar a lot of the time. So having this, I just write everything down every assignment or whatever, you know, however you have, you keep your brain and every, all your assignments. Planners are important. Um, and then, especially when you're going to a program like this, nursing school, med school, grad tech school, whatever, having that will just keep everything organized and you'll stress less. And they're not that expensive either. It, um, I may do an updated one. I just, I couldn't wait. I just wanted to show you all what I had so far. Also, I've got some sticky notes. I also really love sticky notes. Working in the medical field, we use a lot of sticky notes and I've just kind of become accustomed to it. So, sticky notes for the win. I'll put this in my little pencil bag. Really exciting things came in the mail. My x-ray markers came in today or a few days ago, but I'm just now kind of getting a really good look at them and I am so excited. You just don't even know. Let me open them. Let me open them. So I ordered these off of Etsy. You can get them off of, um, there's like a site that my um, advisor recommended, but you can also get them off of Etsy. Um, Amazon has some, or you can just Google x-ray markers. Just make sure that for your program, a specific program, that you get the, the right kind that your um that you have like that your program requires because ours required a certain they have to look a certain way and be a certain way so which can be a little bit more expensive but i can't wait till i graduate and i can get the kind of like marker that i want so anyway so um i got mine uh well first of all this is what they look like so we have a obviously a left and a right one our right one had to be red and then the left one had to be blue and then we also had to get our initials in there and then these are the bb markers um that came that comes with them so for my program we have to have two sets of x-ray markers and if you guys don't know what an x-ray marker is it's basically when you take an image an x-ray um you have to sit it on like obviously on the left like so that you can mark like this is the left side or this is the right side but someone's right tibia this is someone's left humerus or something like that ivy de uh, design goods off of etsy and she does a lot of different things this was a um custom order because obviously i had to have obviously like the, the certain colors but she has badge reels and stuff if you order from her she'll do a little discount on your next purchase which i definitely will be uh getting a badge reel from her uh, she also, if uh, you can pay a little bit more for these adhesives. I don't know how long these will last, but adhesive is very important, um, obviously, so it can stick. I don't know why I thought it was magnetic, but it's actually um, 
you get these like sticky thingies. Um, a lot of people have a certain kind that they like. Um, hopefully these last me for a long time, but I got two, one, two, four sets of two. So should last me a while, hopefully we'll see. But I'm so excited. I'm just like, your girl is official. She got her badge markers. I mean, she got her x-ray markers. I can't wait to get like the cutesy ones. But we have to be basic and have these in school, so. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna put these in here and zip her up. Oh, almost had a straggler. I'm gonna put that in there. And then the last thing that I have to show you for today, um, I'll also have like a cup, you know, for water, coffee, whatever. Um, chargers, I have a charger here I actually always keep there. Um, my computer will also be with me. Uh, I'm debating on whether I want to get an iPad. I, I went through college without having an iPad, so I think I'll be fine without it. Uh, it's just like a unnecessary thing if you want it, you know? Um, and then again, I will update you guys uh, like if we have more things to add on the packing list. But I also got a lunch bag. This was for Marshall. Oh no, this is TJ Maxx. This was $9.99. And I just wanted to like, you know, be able to bring my lunch and not eat out every single day. Um, I don't know if my school has a cafeteria or anything, but I mean, I'm grown, I'm not a college kid anymore. Like a young college kid, I can make my own food. So I, I'll bring my lunch um, with me. This is just a plain black lunch bag. Um, it's like insulated a little bit, so nothing special. But I will have that. And I used to clip my, I don't think I have a clip on here, right? But I mean, I do have a clip, but not the kind of clip I'm thinking about. But I used to have it and I used to like have it on the back of my book bag. Oh, the nostalgia. Okay, so that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you are a Rad Tech student or a Rad Tech, let me know what you're taking to school, what you recommend. If I'm missing anything, I probably am. Um, let me know in the comments and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.